Hi y'all, happy hit belly here. We're back on the road again. Um, I think this is Lakeview Lake, I think. I'm not real sure. Uh, we're over here and there's somebody there and I haven't seen anybody else here. It's uh, $20 a night for electric. They don't have water hookups, but they do have potable water. No electric in the tent area, but they do have a separate tent area. And there's a lake right down there. It's pretty. Pavilion over there. I guess for group picnics. <coughs> Another pavilion here. Lots of picnic tables. Big grill, I guess, for big ones. Sorry, Dinky. Kicked her right in the butt. She stopped right in front of me. <laughs> well, they got flush toilets, it looks like. But there's no telling what else is in there until we look, huh? Looks like it's just these two. Just restrooms. No showers. Come on. Come on. No, no showers. Just toilets. Playground for kids. I got garbage cans. The only reason I'm here is because I got electricity. And I'm keeping the air conditioner plugged up with that. It's not real bad right now, believe it or not. I'm out here walking around. Don't feel like I'm going to die. Look at that lake out there. It's a fishing lake. And they've got a few sites. Like, I don't know. I think like eight with electric and then the rest without a handful of them. So, it's a nice lake. Real nice lake. Starting to get a little warm out here in the sun now. I'll come around that loop. Or actually I cheated. I came halfway around. It's a nice lake down there. Sorry about that, I had that tilted. I mean, this is a city park. So, don't expect a whole lot, but it's a nice one for a city park. It's real nice. It's quiet, I mean, there ain't very many people down here. Yeah, it's Lakeview Lake. So, I know. I didn't come up with that name. But see, there's a highway just right there. But you can't really hear it because you go real slow. But this is a public fishing lake too. Look, it says, there you go. It's Fort Fish Restoration Area. Welcome to Lakeview Lake. Public fishing, City of Mexico, in cooperation with Missouri Conservation Department. So this is Mexico, Missouri. Dogs must be leashed. I saw some down there not on leash. 
But people don't read those signs. They need to start reading them. Because that's what it is, man. Anyway, here's the dump station. Hose required. So, apparently you got to have your own hose. So, that's it. Park closed at 11 p.m. That means after 11, the bus comes in, I guess. Well, I guess that means nobody's going out either. Thing is, I didn't see no gate anywhere. No gate at all. And there's your register pay box. So this is a first come, first serve. It is $20 for electric hookups. Ten dollars if you're tent camping. They have a spot for a camp host. No camp host. That's a really good spot too, and they got it all blocked off. Nobody else gets to use it. So. But yeah, there's a. These sites are a little weird. I mean, I've never really seen them like this. But these ones, there's a middle row and this edge row. Now on the edge row, each one of those pull-ins is for two spaces. That's for two separate campers. But these over here, like the one I'm parked in, there are four in each thing. They're back, two of them back to back. And there's one, two, three of those. And one, two of the others. So that'll be, well, 16 spots here to go camp at with electric. Now this one might be for two, just the two. Cause it's only got one long line down the center but like this one is for four spots see how they have it divided off that's what you have to do you have to be in one of these well, anyway that's our tour around this is lakeview lake mexico missouri twenty dollars a night if you want electricity ten dollars if you don't and the park does close at 11 p.m., so don't plan on getting here late. Get here early. But right now, there's only two of us that I know of here. That one over there, I don't think anybody's here. I think they just parked it, plugged it, and left it. Because, you know, selfish people do that. But okay. <sighs> nice little place. It's not bad. It's only about 82 degrees right now. Got some trees. A little bit of shade. Of course, like I said, I've got the air conditioner plugged out. There you go. See how they stand and wait until I unhook them before they try to go in? They're smart dogs. So... <sighs> Let me try to show you a little bit of what I got going on. So I added this seat back in, this swivel seat. So I've got a side seat to sit in. Of course, right now it's got a big bag of dog food in it. Of course, my bed is in the same place. A little messy. Air conditioner. Uh, uh, clothes in that basket. Personal ship. More clothes back there. All kinds of stuff, including my new cutie. This is cutie. She's our new van plant. And you can probably guess why I named her cutie. <laughs> but yeah, that's her name. So I got that shelf from my friend, that plant. <laughs> um, I moved all of those drawers up to on top of that. The refrigerator's still down there. And then I've got this new shelf and the microwave is down there and then there's more storage and under that one and 
I just got this stove top bungee right there. I'll take it outside if I want to cook. Because it's hot. It's summertime, people. And the toilet is up there. Which it fits in there just really nice. You know? Yeah. Of course, yeah. And, of course, I do still have a couple extra boxes here. I'll figure out what to do with. But we're all good. We still got room to move around in here. I think he's down there with bone. But that air conditioner, between that air conditioner and this fan, we're staying pretty cool right now. It's a nice day. It's a good day. So that's the interior of the van now. Yeah, a house plant. Why not? Had to have a house plant. Sorry about that. But yeah. So that's the way it looks right now. And I'm okay with it. It works out alright. Clothes up and down in there. And whatever else is in there. I have no idea what that is. Huh, I'll find out later. Yep. Oh, and I got a house lamp. <laughs> I was tired of it being dark. I don't like it dark. Got a fan up there pushing it this way. Air conditioner pushing it that way. But that's it for today. Mexico, Missouri. We've redone some stuff in the van. Turned some stuff around. It's all good. And we got that extra seat. So, I get to sit upright when I want to. <laughs> Instead of having to try to turn in sideways in that one or sit on the bed. And Dinky is going to town on that big bone. Now, I got one for Brutus, but Dinky took it and hid it. So, I don't know where it's at. Yeah, you did. You know you did. Anyway, thanks for joining us, y'all. Uh, happy Hillbilly here. Mexico, Missouri. Stretched out, relaxing, chilling, living the life. On our way to New York, not the city. Gonna go see my granddaughter. And everybody else that lives there too. See all the sweet babies. And their lovely mama and daddy. Okay, well, later, y'all. Hope y'all have a good evening. I'm gonna.